as we see them, okay? Because when you're playing a shot of 50, 60, 70 yards, anything that's not full, the setup needs to be narrower, a bit closer to the golf ball, rather than that sort of full width of stance. And as we can see now, that ball's a long way back in your stance with the shaft leaning forward. So what you're going to encourage now from a normal swing, if you stayed there, that club's going to come down very steep. The fact the ball's back in the stance, very steep, dig into the ground, or if anything, just drive the ball low. You've lost a lot of loft on that golf club. All the spin's going to be reduced anyway. Now the ball's going to go quite low and probably go too far. Yeah. And a good shot, the ball then goes too far. The next time on the golf course you have this length shot, you go, oh, the last one went too far. I'll slow the swing down. So you swing back to the same position, all the way back as you were doing here now, go back quite a long way, and they, oh, I want too much power. I'll try and slow the swing down, and you duff it. Okay? With a pitch shot, we want to be a more neutral shaft, a bit more utilising the full loft of the golf club, narrower stance, ball now is fairly much centred as you can see there, it felt quite a long way forward to reality didn't it, yeah, it was yeah, fairly yeah. centred there and we're going to maintain that position now on the left side as we swing back, judge the backs are the same length backs and they're going shorter now because we've got more loft and a smaller setup. so the speed we're creating now through impact is good, just keeping that head there on occasions we get a little bit leaning back just, just a smidgen there yeah, okay. Yeah. Just not staying through to the left hand side. It's almost like staying down longer and everything rises up. So your yeah. spine's rising up. It's not your head lifting. Okay. Right. Yeah. Yes, your head is going slightly this way, but you're not going and doing that. Yeah. So don't try and cure this then by doing that. Okay. Yeah. So as we swing through now, but get more loft on that golf club, the ball's coming out nicely. We can then twist through upon that left side with a sort of comfortable length swing. Possibly a little bit long, I would suggest. Yeah. Okay. Almost like you're trying to almost add loft and that's why add speed and distance to the shot. Once you set the back swing, the sort of through swing now sort of comes with the same amount. Okay, so half swing is half sort of both sides, yeah. rather than sort of too short and then trying to add some power. Okay, possibly part of that is the fact you hit the ground a bit behind the ball. You try to sort of save the shot as you hit it and it's just get going a bit too far. But overall, if we can get a more neutral setup, okay, shaft sort of more vertical rather than preset forward. As we can see in that case, there you go. even that there, you just deal off the club there by just doing that with your wrist, to be fair. So that's going to take a lot of loss off the club face, that first movement. But a more neutral shaft, better ball position, and just keeping that weight on that left. I don't try to get under the ball to add loft, okay? As we said, backspin comes from club head speed and loft. If you've got enough loft on the golf club, the ball comes out high enough and it will land a lot quicker with more backspin, okay? Yeah. Don't try to lean back and flick it or bury the club in the ground. It's getting that club sort of slide under the golf ball with a good angle of attack, which will come from a better setup. Yeah. The ball back in the stand, you're just coming down too steep. Unless you start leaning back, which your old method used to do, yeah. Yeah, which yeah. is why your pitching was quite good. But yeah. we want to try and improve your long game, which we certainly have in the last video, and keep your short game still good. Yeah. Okay? Good. Make sense, yeah? yeah absolutely. Good stuff. Right, have a couple more now, mate. Then. Again, try and change targets, okay? Don't always go for the 60s red flag or the thing. Maybe hit one shot to the 50, one this near, one one's the far right flag of the, so different shots each and every time, okay?